A little while ago, I made a video talking about downsides of cloud, talked about how it's kind of overhyped and it's more expensive. And if you're trying to make money, cloud storage is certainly not way to go because data centers are way cheaper. And we talked about a few other reasons, but today I figured other situations when cloud is beneficial. Like if I would uh, to pick for myself, when would I use cloud? Or I guess more in general, let's talk about when I think cloud technologies are appropriate to your business. And where I would start is if you are starting a new business. If you're a brand new company, you want to do whatever technology related and you need infrastructure. Cloud is no brainer, absolutely. If I wanted to start my own e-discovery company or do something else, I could get started, you know, in days, uh, maybe even hours, have my own, you know, cloud infrastructure, virtual machines going. So if you start in a new business, and you want to get started quickly and you don't want to deal with figuring out data centers, servers, installing, all that stuff. Cloud is absolutely a way to go. And perhaps the main source of revenue for your new company isn't going to be document storage. You're not going to be charging client for hosting or it may be a small portion of it. Maybe you're going into consulting or something else that's going to be primary reason uh, to go there. So higher data storage cost in the cloud isn't that big of a deal or you're able to pass them on to, to the client and again, not worry about it too much. Oh, another great reason to go to the cloud is if you are frustrated with your IT department. Now, I've been super lucky that I had really great IT support throughout my whole Lit Support career. Uh, there was one place where it was uh, not so great, but I've seen and I heard stories about horrible, horrible IT support. You know, there is basically no support, problems don't get resolved, you know, you're trying to uh, upgrade things, improve things, nothing is happening, you just get excuses why, you know, that's how things are, this is how they're going to be, slow computers, slow servers, basically just nothing but frustration and at some point you're like, I can't listen to this anymore, I don't want to talk to these people anymore, I just want my stuff to work and this is where you can migrate your applications or whatever to the cloud for hopefully better experience. What about need to expand quickly? If I were to start my own EDD company, let's say I have two or three clients and I'm handling projects and everything's going fine and suddenly a new client comes out and says, I need you to host, you know, this many terabytes for me. And with a data center, you know, I'm screwed. I can't handle it. You know, whatever capacity I have, I can expand it, but there's no way I can burst it to accommodate you know, big projects. Well, if I were to use cloud technology, I could, I can expand. I have basically infinite expandability to my IT infrastructure. So I would be able to handle way larger projects than I could in my data center in a shorter period of time. There are also a lot of cool, cheap features you can get on the cloud. So for example, my application message crawler, I want to store my activation key online. So if somebody loses them, they can click a button and their key could be downloaded. Well, I created AWS database on Amazon and the storage is absolutely minimal. All I'm storing is just the text strings of the license serial numbers. And so that database costs me absolutely nothing. And convenience is just enormous. Imagine trying to have your own server and uh, people connect to it. Just so you could store some serial numbers. I mean, that, that'd be crazy. But having AWS do it for you and it costs you almost nothing. I mean, that's a no brainer to create something like that. And of course, cloud offers services that you just can't get any other way. For example, uh, document translation. It would be pretty much impossible for you to get your own software, buy software installed in your own data center to do that. So what you can do is you can have your own desktop application, uh, whatever normal application you have, web application, and then just tap into the cloud for whatever additional functionality you need. And that's what I do with my message crawler. Uh, again, I have a desktop application that does whatever it needs to do, but there are certain features. Uh, for example, image content identification. For that, I connect to Amazon, use their services to figure out the content of the image, save their information, present it to a user, 
and I'm done. I'm not using cloud like to store my data there. All I'm doing is I'm uploading them there temporarily, get it processed and download results. And that is great use for the cloud for the features that you just can't get in your application or in your data center. Are there any other reasons why you should choose the cloud? Let me know in the comment section below. Don't forget to follow on LinkedIn, subscribe on YouTube, and I'll see you next time.